Hundreds gathered in temples in northeast Thailand on Saturday, offering candles, toys and prayers to mark the lives of the mostly child victims of a gun and knife rampage that shocked the world. Over 30 people died in Thursday's attack when a former Bangkok police officer went on a rampage at a daycare center in Uthai Sawan, including dowering Jamnognid's two-year-old son, Patarawat, nicknamed Captain, after a famous actor. A toy dinosaur and a bottle of milk were placed on top of his coffin. On the day of the incident, I didn't give him a call. I normally do that every morning. It was raining that day, and I was in a hurry to go to work, so I didn't call him. I didn't get to say a word to him. Every morning I would call him, and he would say, I'm going to school now, Mum. I didn't get to talk to him. Police identified the attacker as Panya Kamrap, a former police sergeant who was facing trial on a drugs charge. It was not clear if the gunman still used drugs, although police say his autopsy found no evidence of drug use at the time of his death. Authorities said after carrying out the massacre, he returned home and shot his wife and child before turning his weapon on himself. Police were seen questioning residents on Saturday near the home of the attacker. Shocked neighbours said he did not mingle much. Fuan Polieum lived just opposite Panya. She said she hid with her children when she heard gunshots, adding she had to cover her son's mouth so he would be quiet, as she was afraid they would be next. A spokesperson for Prime Minister Priyut Chanucha said on Saturday that he was concerned about trauma in the community. Thursday's attack was one of the world's worst recent child death tolls in a massacre by a single killer.